Sorry, I was talking to Ember. What's up? Oh, yeah, um, <laughs> thanks for dropping by. Uh, we're about to get into some games real quick. Um, you? Oh, yeah, the board. It definitely sounds like it's been nice and catering to you, like mine has been, and I'm glad oh, yeah. that we both have that, because I, I would have like wanted nothing, with, yeah, nothing know. less than that, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling great. <laughs> My eyes are doing this thing, this thing where it's like, they're, they're vibing with their feels on their position. And if that makes weird sense, I'm very sorry. <laughs> it, um, yeah. And then, like, there's also the fact that, um, Ember came home and she gave me a sandwich. That was fantastic. Ah, oh, dude. That was a great sandwich. Thank you, Ember. I was just thinking about something. That was awesome. I'm doing good, though. Yeah. Um, I think I have to restart my client. Oh. What? There's statues there? Ember, there are statues underneath the thing that you said that there are statues. What? Yeah, like, it, the, the statues. Remember that one thing that we were like a paladinian or whatever it was, that term that I brought up and then we were talking about it and then we had looks on it, right? Well, I had a bunch of windows open, and apparently they were covering up some other statues, and, like, they're exactly what I would call statues, but then you opened my eyes to, like, something else somebody would call a statue, and I'm like, whoa. Too many words for myself for a second. I need to focus. Focus. Open my eyes. <laughs> I can't focus if I can't see. a terrifying thought. I am so worried about myself. <laughs> what do you think of her? Should I share it? <laughs> Should I share it? Yeah, okay, fine. I'll share it. I was thinking about the cabbage plant icon. I was like, wow, we could grow a head of cabbage out there. I can viciously rip it out of the ground as soon as it grows and then cut straight into it like a fucking monster. And then I was like, wow, thought, you kind of got a little out of control there. <laughs> and that's why I said um, it seemed a little out of control. It was a bit unhinged. No, I refuse to click the button. What are you playing? I'm playing the one player game, you know the two player challenge thing, right? Well, if you click the one player part on it, right, you'll be able to go into this match mode game thing and then you're just like matching tiles and then I'm doing that 
when I'm waiting for my PC to load and stuff. It's loading so much faster today. It's doing a fantastic job. Who do I have to beg to, like, have the sound effects separated from ambience? Plus. <laughs> Here's the thing. I appreciate the ambience so much. I'm willing to tolerate the loud ass freaking sound effects of a. Oh my gosh, he clicked a button and now everything is exploding. Like. <laughs> like I can tolerate that just so I can hear the ambience a little bit more. However, I, I feel like. The background just changed. There's no more city. It's just the desert. Never uh, mind. I'm not talking anymore. Should have no, your cell phone. Should have shut up. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Could you imagine if it was actually like that? Wow, man. I was like, there to bring my cell phone and maybe like a satellite dish. Uh, that sounds pretty good. Yeah. And a toolkit. A toolkit. You don't have to pay for heating. You don't. You don't have to pay for heating, and then you can dress up in your craziest out-looking outfits during the night when it gets cold. <laughs> so I mean, it's not completely bad, I guess. Gotta be grateful, regardless. Of the moment, you know, even if you sound like a crazy bastard, <laughs> I don't know. Um, it, a satellite dish in the tool belt. I think I'm pretty sad. If you get me Wi-Fi, if you get me Wi-Fi and a reliable uh, gaming <laughs> situation that connects me to the games that I'm currently caring about, I think I could handle it, <laughs> possibly. However, I need food and water and nutrients. That would be the covering. Fifteen jars of peanut butter on my belt as well. Where are we going for the renewable part? Like, we have to go somewhere to go and get the stuff, like groceries. Like, are there faraway farms? Oh, we brought it with us. We've been carrying it the whole time. <laughs> it just has that many jars of peanut butter on it. So ideally you mainly want a house because of like rain and like other crazy weather conditions. Hey, but if it's man. just rain hot, lots of peanut butter. like, like peanut if it's peanut just peanut hot outside peanut. and sometimes the rain is relieving, then I mean it can't be like there's just like some minor things you'd want to do for comfortability some reasons. Saran wrap. Did you know you can saran wrap four trees in the woods and then saran wrap around two trees and make a top that goes on top of the four trees and set it on the top and then you have yourself a saran wrap hut. You can cut yourself a door in it and call it a day with some duct tape. <laughs> Honestly, I'm kind of willing to see just how much I can tolerate as long as I'm getting enough gaming time in each day. I seen it tried on the survival show, dude. It oh man, crazy. there's some days that I don't even get to play games and that would be like though, losing the games temporarily. Scary, okay. right? <laughs> that's fucking scary. Uh, you can know. see everything around you. You know though, but the, the bright side. On the bright side, the pioneering from that little bit of thought I was thinking about because it's like ideally, if you could get you could find a balance, you could find a balance ideally, and if you could find that balance, you could ideally go literally absolutely anywhere because you've now made it comfy like home absolutely anywhere you go. You could 
and thus adventure would set free and you would be able to go anywhere you you see just know where you don't and in which case you could broaden your learning maybe and you could then open up the site necessary to get into those places however it's never gonna stop we're gonna keep trying to find a way into it. all of the freaking places where are the places I need to find more places I'm just kidding there's video games too and I like lingering on that stuff however what are this I'm just technically fighting a program made just for me to fight like they literally had to give me something to fight that its existence is bent around just to settle me down and I just get moody when I know it's like wow man however I can't let go of it it's too good it's way too good Uh, these these programs they've made are so fantastic like seriously that like the amount of time and effort it took to make them but then like the amount of like attention I'm giving it I definitely need to like say something about because it's a clear example of just how much I like these things. <laughs> like, the video games are really good. Okay. This air containment is like so good that they help me understand that they're based off of something that is even better than just how so good the games are, and that's life. So it's not that the life is like a game it's that games are like a life and that you can learn a lot in that short amount of time that you're given to experience a story unfolding before your very eyes that you think you have some bit of control on but in fact it's you bought the game to play and it has its missions and its moment and then you go through that and it's like that in life in the sense that but then like it's really confusing because it's in what I was saying how like life's not like the game it's that the game's like life <sighs> it's so crazy though to even be having this conversation with myself. Oh well. I don't know, wait around to have it with somebody. That's for damn sure. If I'm gonna be waiting around to have that conversation with somebody, I'm gonna be going through hell waiting forever. <laughs> uh. And it will always be about stuff I never saw coming, which is pretty nice. Or stuff that I just don't want to talk about. Or, I don't know. Sometimes it's really nice because there needs to be a balance. What the fuck happened to my eyes? I love hearing it. Wow. It's just I don't want to have it be all I'm hearing. I think you know what I'm saying. I think you're just like getting worried and concerned. In which case, you, you, like, who cares so much, and thank you. Now, what are you saying under having a good news? Your items? When, what do you mean, items? Your items? <laughs> Every time it gives me anxiety and I just wish it would stop. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. So anxiety is good because there needs to be balance. Balance. Balance.
So it gave me two void, uh, void point characters in consecutive order. That, that's nice. However, the void doesn't have a healer, and I don't accept that. So I'm not gonna be able to have that. give it back to me. No worries. Alright. 
are you feeling today, Ember? reacting to stuff in my head. why I like see now there's all this really nice ambience that I wouldn't want to be without and instead like I know right <laughs> There we go. 